Welcome back. So, do you have a ton of candle jars and you want to repurpose them? You want to figure out how to repurpose them? Well, I'm going to show you how to clean them so we can repurpose these. So, first of all, we need water. Turn it on. I'm using a nice shallow frying pan and I am going to, I know, lovely attire, huh? <laughs> I'm going to put this in, inside just so uh, my jars do not rattle on the bottom. And if you have a non-stick pan that you're using, um, you're taking a bigger chance of, uh, have the right one on, yes. You're taking a bigger chance of uh, scratching your pans if you do not put a liner in it. So I do not need my lids. I'm just going to put these in here. And I believe one more will fit. No. Nope. Will this one fit? Yeah. Um, it does fit, but you guys, I'm only going to do two. I don't want to take a chance in breaking one. Because not only can you repurpose these, you guys, bring you a little closer. Well, these are great. For gift ideas. You get these cleaned out. And you can make some beautiful, beautiful homemade gifts. And have your containers already. Bath salts. You could put a bag of bath salts in here. A small candle. Oh my gosh, the opportunity, the ideas are endless. And in here, once you clean them out, you wash them, put them in the dishwasher, sterilize them. You're not going to smell the candle scent anymore. These totally come off and apart, so you can also soak and wash these. They're great for in your pantry. Uh, little snacks. You have extra popcorn. Maybe you don't use microwave popcorn. You use regular pop popcorn. Like I said, the ideas are endless. We'll be back. I've decided I might as well just let the video go for a little bit. We don't have to have super hot water. All we need is enough to um, loosen the wax so we can dump it out and clean it. So I'm going to let that go for a little while. I have a couple of dishes to wash up. from our fudge. I think our wax is starting to melt and you guys if you purchase any you know fake greenery from Dollar Tree Target Walmart any of your stores um, hold on I'm cleaning things um, they get dusty and since we're in the cleaning thing I am gonna toss these in the dishwater and just wash them up real quick just swizzle them around. Rinse them. Put them in a the strainer to dry. And we have beautiful, clean greenery again. It's 
easiest way, you guys, a lot of this greenery you can even put in uh, your dishwasher. Okay, let's see here. Paper towel. This is probably a good idea so I don't burden my little hands. Turn that down. <clears throat> Again, I'm going to use a Dollar Tree pot holder. Oh my gosh, yeah, you guys, totally. Can you see it? Going in the garbage. Um, okay, so problem. It has to melt more in order to actually get out of the hole. And I got wax on my favorite Dollar Tree pot holder. Just let it melt some more. But you guys see how easily they come right out. Let's try this one. Yeah, and you know how to not get soot all over your candle? Trim your candle wick before you um before you light it up. All right, I'm gonna find something I can just cut that with. Chop it. I wonder if I can chop it in half. No, nope, not yet. All right. I'm going to put you guys on pause while I continue this. And of course, you know, I'm making a huge mess. And I have to turn on the uh, fan to get rid of this moisture. But let's try to get rid of this one. See if we can get rid of it now. Oh, they're trying. They're just going to keep melting them. Ooh, that one came out very easily. And we will just dump it. And you guys, while it is still warm, watch out. Get yourself a paper towel. Stuff it in there. Clean it out. Clean that hot wax. It's not hot, hot. You can hold it in your hands. Caution on the bottom. These jars stay warm for a very long time. Warm. And like I said, they are going to go in the sink to be clean and then they will go in the dishwasher to be sterilized this can get dumped put the next one in Wipe that wax out. I do suggest holding on to it with a pot holder so you do not burn yourself. Get rid of all that wax, excess wax. Stuff that paper towel way down deep in there. It's all ready to go in the sink and then the dishwasher. You guys, that's how you clean and get rid of all that excess wax that we just don't need, can't get to. You can save it if you want and pour it into something else, but there's no sense. 
and for video purposes, I'm just dumping it out. Like, comment, subscribe, share if you like these type of videos. And I'll see you in the next video. You guys have a great day.